Okay, welcome back to Florida Naturally, and we are in lovely Dade City today, actually just a little bit north of there, and we are at the Little Everglades Steeplechase, uh, which is at Little Everglades Ranch, and we have uh, Karen Streaker here. Hi, Karen. Hi, glad you're here. Yeah, well, this is wonderful. This is my first year here. Tell us what a steeplechase is. Yeah, it originated in Ireland, uh, where two men that were fox hunters mm -hmm. uh, decided they would race to the steeple, mm -hmm. and uh, it was a chase to the steeple as the church steeples are the highest things uh -huh. in the area and so they raced from steeple to steeple uh -huh. and the first uh, steeplechase race there was no prize money and it was just for fun but now we do have um, some good sized purses for these people to run against uh, each other and um, that makes it even more interesting uh -huh. but with us we have a turf course that's a mile and a quarter uh, long and the horses run around the course twice will be about a two and a half miles. Mm -hmm. uh, they jump a series of hurdles, natural brush fences that are um, almost five feet tall. And they'll jump 12 of those fences going around twice. These horses really have to be fit because they're not only racing on the flat, they're jumping at the same time. What are we talking about for money? Um, our purse, purses today are $100,000. Yeah, our top race is uh, $35,000. That's our highest purse today. Uh, tell us about the Jack Russell races, Jack Russell Terrier races. Jack Russell races are a hoot. We have people that come to our race meet just for them. I don't think they even see the horses go around. But um, no, the Jack Russell races, the Terrier races, um, are, are, they have their own little set of hurdles that they jump over. And uh, I think they have like 10 races uh, from puppies on up to older dogs that uh, have been racing for quite a few years and everybody loves them. So the veterans 10 years and older. Yes, right. And, and there are a lot of them. They, they have a lot of energy and they're ready to run and chase that foxtail or scented cloth, whatever they use these days. I was talking to a fellow a little earlier that uh, had a Jack Russell he was walking around with, and I said, are you in the race? He says, well, we were last year, but he took off, and he, he didn't like the race, and he turned around tail and ran the other way. So <laughs> that, was a, that was his first and only time in the race. Right. Some of them love it, and some of them just don't get the picture. <laughs> uh, you also have tailgate judging here. Tell us about that. That's another really fabulous um, thing that we do here. People go all out. We had people come in the day before the races and set up a, a whole theme, maybe a Polynesian village. <laughs> they bring in wicker furniture. They bring in all kinds of uh, uh, accessories to, to ensure that they win. We give nice tailgate prizes, and um, we have different categories, gourmet food, um, the most extravagant. I mean, and, and, they, and they go all out. They love it, and we love having them do it. They bring their silver, their china, um, just tremendous. And you also have a hat judging contest. I, I like your hat, by the way. That's very lovely. Thank you. We have hat contest, and that one I think is probably even bigger than the tailgating. We have 200 to 300 people that get in it, men, women, and children, mm -hmm. and that's a lot of fun. We do that. We actually stop the races in the afternoon for an hour to do our hat contest. Everyone loves to see it. Everybody, we have a little platform. They get up, they parade across. Some people do a little dance. It's just a lot of fun. Karen, tell us how someone can uh, find out more about you, about your uh, event here um, okay. at the uh, Little Everglades Steeplechase. And that's how they can find out. We have a um, website, and it's www.littleevergladesteeplechase.com, or the phone number at the office is 352-521-3661. And we operate... 24-7 basically and um, go 12 months a year working on this race meet so uh, we're glad to talk to anybody. We have sponsorships available. That's a good plug uh -huh. because we always need, we're a 501c3 charity foundation. Mm -hmm. So of course in order to operate to make money for our charities we, we need sponsors. So that's starting to become easier because we're becoming much more well known now and people are calling us. Sure. So if anybody wants to do that we'd just love to have you come aboard. Okay. Hey. Karen Streaker, thanks a lot for talking with us. Thank you so much. I've right. enjoyed it.
fancy but not too fancy. <laughs> so where are you guys from? Steeplechase! 